Teresa Panter was just two short turns away from the finish line at the Boston Marathon Monday when she heard the bombs go off. When she heard the first, she thought it was a cannon. After the second, she and runners around her were told to turn and run back in the direction they came from. With 56 marathons under her belt, including many Boston marathons, Panter is not a newcomer to the races. But she says that for some reason, this race was unusually difficult. And looking back, she thanks God that it was. I had, was struggling during the run, to be honest with you. I've run Boston several times and, and marathons in uh, different states, but at mile 13, for some reason, the, my favorite race in a good, perfect weather for a marathon, I started having a headache and some issues, so I've slowed my pace down. And um, I, I look back on that now and I wonder if God would just slow me down because he needed Alan at the finish line. Hundreds of people now, who have heard her story have well, reached I mean, out in support of Panther and her most... husband. But she says who she thinks the real heroes are. The Boston officials and the Athletic Association was amazing. You felt safe. They volunteered. Um, spectators were given their belts, their clothes for tourniqueting, you know, people that were injured and um, the outpouring, you know, everybody was not thinking of themselves. They were thinking of the victims that suffered this horrible tragedy. 